Hey guys, if you're nice one, and I'm talking about this is a little odd. Okay, well, you guys know esports, right? Well, Team 33, which is an esports team apparently, they signed up an eight year old. I'm not gonna mention his name or nothing. You can check out the Kotaku article. They even got a picture of the kid, I think, on the Kotaku article, right? But they signed an eight year old, right? He's getting a $33,000 signing bonus and a brand new $5,000 gaming setup, right? I'm not gonna go through everything he's supposed to get, but apparently people aren't exactly sure if this is legal. They're not gonna do anything special. This is the CEO of the company. He was claiming like basically they're not flying him out anywhere. He's not entering any tournaments. He's basically just playing like he would play on Saturday or Sunday and they're legally allowed to give him money because they believe in him. That's what this, this is the CEO of the company apparently. And they're making an investment. So basically it doesn't seem like they're really gonna do much with him other than he's just gonna basically game like he normally would like like they said they're entering him in tournaments with no prize money on the line so i assume those would be like those online tournaments that sometimes people have i'm not sure they didn't say that there but basically they were like if he plays too much games and like doesn't do his homework his mother can get him out of the contract and basically they also like when he turns 13 and he's able to actually enter tournaments and stuff like that they basically have the right to refusal. So they can either opt to renegotiate his contract or let another organization sign him, right? So here's the thing. Apparently people aren't sure if this is exactly legal, signing an eight year old, because it's not just like they keeping their eyes on him. They signed him, right? As someone in the comment section in the Kotaku article pointed out, he or she thinks it's creepy. Like he or she was basically like, whether it's for football, or baseball or Fortnite, it's creepy, right? And I kind of agree with that. Eight years old, see, if he was a teenager, whatever. Teenagers, that's more so when you're kind of starting to think about like college and maybe like your future and stuff like that. But to sign an eight year old, even though you're not really planning to do much with him, you're just kind of giving him money and investing in his future so that when he becomes like 13 and eligible for competition, you have dibs almost to use that word but but here's the thing he's eight years old and definitely pray for this kid because this kid man it's just like child actors like making that amount of money at that age two things like first of all the kid can really it can mess with you i think but two parents like parents can take advantage of that parents could look at that just as oh look at all that money my kid's making more than me I mean, I don't know whether he would be making more money than his parents, but parents can take advantage and I think mess up kids like careers because parents can kind of take advantage of what the kid is making and whatnot. Hopefully they don't, God willing, you know, pray that she doesn't. But this is still a little creepy. At eight years old, it is a little creepy. I agree with the person who made the comment. Like, it's eight years old. You're done signing him. It's not like those sports teams that just say, we're going to keep an eye on you, kid. No. They're signing him already. And I know that the CEO claimed they're not flying him anywhere, like he's not going out to any tournaments or whatnot, but still, to sign an eight-year-old, I don't know. I know it's eSport League, and I know, like, we have child actors, you know, at eight years old, I guess, but it's still weird. Because even if it was like a basketball team, yeah, it'd be weird like if the Chicago Bulls signed an eight-year-old in advance, hey, when you graduate from high school, we have dibs on whether to sign you or not, okay? It'd just be weird because at that age, like at that age, you don't almost accept anything. But what do you guys think? I mean, do you guys think it's fine for them to sign an eight-year-old and just, you know, invest in his future with the esports league, I guess? Or do you guys find it a little bit weird and maybe think there should be a limit at what age you can sign them? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, like, and subscribe, and may God bless you all.